Hey, I'm just here. I'm eating my bowl of fresh cut up watermelon, but I am, I have so much excitement. I can't even contain myself. Tomorrow is June 1st and I had decided to do a challenge for June for starting tomorrow and then come to find out Ted Carr which is an amazing fruitarian youtuber if you haven't heard of him already definitely go check out his channel he's been putting out videos for years great content I will link his channel below but he decided to do a melon fruitarian challenge raw food challenge for the entire month of june as well, as well. and it totally got me pumped and psyched to originally i was going to do two weeks 14 days but i'm going to do the full 30 days with him i don't know him he doesn't know me but i figured what a great way to share and get this bus of fruitarianism going and in first gear so what the awesome thing is about not only myself doing it but also Ted Carr is that we are in two areas of the world that a ton of people can relate to so I am in New York Ted is in Canada and we are not on a small tropical island I know you know a lot of fruitarians are either in Bali or even Hawaii a lot are in Hawaii and that is such a small population. Let's say Hawaii is like 0 0.005 population, I don't know, of the United States. And then raw foodists are 0 0.00125 of that population. So not many people can relate to them at all, nor find the fruits that they're eating. I know I can't in New York. It's absolutely impossible to find the fruits that they are eating. So I am doing this raw challenge from New York. Like I said, Ted's doing it from Canada and his is focusing on melons for the month of June. And mine is melons, grapes, and berries. So I'm going under the Dr. Morris protocol. Let's do it. I want you guys to do it too. Who's ever watching to get on this bus, <laughs> you know, it's like the yellow fruitarian bus and we're going to get on and we're going to start driving and we're going to get our friends on and our parents on and our kids on and just get more fruit into the diet of everyone. <laughs> so that's my goal and I'm really excited about it because one of the things to do it and to succeed is to have a passion and all of our passions are different. My passion is curing or getting rid of my Lyme's bacteria out of my body. So that's my number one passion. So figure out what your passion is, why you want to do this, why you, what is it in your life that you want more of? Do you want to lose more weight? Do you want to have more energy? Do you want to feel more vibrant? Do you, you know, just want to do well at work, feel abundant, have an abundant lifestyle, figure out your passion and then just get on this bus and let's go, let's go for a ride for the month of June. So I'm totally excited about that. This challenge is going to be so simple too. It's just fruit. It's a knife, cutting open a melon and eating it. It's not these crazy recipes or anything like that. Like I said, head over to Ted's uh, channel. That's Ted Carr and he's, you know, doing it for other reasons than me, but he has really great videos from his past, tons of resources on everything from, you know, the nutrition of fruit to taking care of your teeth and sports. He's a phenomenal triathlete and runner as well. That's how I got into him many, many years ago. I started following his channel when I was trying to get into triathlons before my limes went up another notch. So. I would definitely suggest checking him out and comment to me below. Let me know if you're on the fruitarian bus for the, <laughs> for the month of June and I will have videos hopefully every day. So I am going to enjoy this amazing watermelon and I look forward to hearing from you. Subscribe to my channel, subscribe to Ted's channel. Like I said, I don't know him. He doesn't know me. I thought by getting this message out and hitting more people. Maybe he'll bring traffic to my channel and get this out as well. You know, I'm being transparent, but I like what he's doing and I hope you like what I'm doing and grab a watermelon and eat it and love your fruit and your fruit will love you. Cheers. Mm.
Tickle, 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 tickle